we could, I mean, let's have a look at the sheets. Uh, we need souls to raid the embassy. We need to hunt rats. Well, we uh, could just go back to the tattoo parlor now. Or we wanted to gain shadowy. How do we gain shadowy? Yeah, we, so we, that was in spite. We did opportunism in spite. Mm -hmm. We can waylay a weasel yeah. seller again. This time fail. The weasel seller turns at last moment. You cut the strikes his shoulder instead. He shouts a command. His cage is spring open. You rush into the night, yelling in pain. Weasel attack to every part of your anatomy. It takes you painful minutes to detach them all. Although you do hang on to one particularly lucky little fellow. So this does increase our shadowy, but it also increases our wounds. Okay. Let's rob a honey den. Is, is, isn't honey just crystal meth in this universe? Yep. Let's go. The honey business oh, is booming enough that you, your appearance as a new customer is not remarked upon. Your accomplice's honey out seizure goes off marvelously, and you proceed unseen to the back rooms of the den. It is there the work of a few moments to find honey pot, unimaginably hidden in the pantry. Alas, this den has very nearly run dry of its sticky treasure and you're left empty-handed after you pay off your associates for its undeniably fine performance. We didn't actually lose anything here. So no, considering Shadow Week increases if we f uh, fail or succeed anyway, that was sh no, doesn't really matter that we failed. That is true, but there's probably better ways to increase our shadowy, right? Is there? Where? Oh, doesn't, doesn't, doesn't the amount of shadowy go up depending on how hard the challenge is? Well, yeah, this one was 30%, right? Oh, this was 30%! No, never mind. I thought it was much higher. This one, this one is 36, and we did it twice. We succeeded once, we failed once. It's the best thing we have here. Yeah, but I don't want to. I don't want to min max too hard. Let's see if there's anything else to do. I got a min max a little hard. I mean, we could rob a drunk. Sure. You wanna? You wanna yep. rob a marine? Fall asleep in the corner around here. Someone needs educating. You're doing him a favor, but who is he when he's not snoring in three inches of street slurry? I would. uh... Rob a cavalry officer. The u that's the uniform of the 23 Nephi Rifles, though he's long since sold his brass buttons. For the cheapest gin by the smell. Yep, let's loot him. Right, Shadow, burn that image into your brain for a second for me. That, okay. That, that smoke bottle. Sell a collection of junk, brass balls of mess in, leather of paper scraps. Wait, are these map fragments? You scrolled for a cat on the back of one. Lucky you're here to help. And now we're gonna quickly travel here. Uh, we're gonna do this. Ah uh, no, I thought the primordial shrieks looked like that, but they really don't. Damn it. We do, One we day we will find these primordial shrieks, dude. We should, at some point, make these vermin free. Well, how many actions we got? Eight. We could we just, could. just try it. Yeah. All right. Bad case of rats. rats. We can duel them. If we want more shadow. We can try for this. Duel the ringleaders and ploys out of each. Red yeah. Team. Yes. Hoodwink them. You acquire a pistol in a fine mahogany case and make a show of secting, secreting it within reach of your bed. Secreting? How do you write secreting if this is secreting? Uh, that's a good question actually. I'm gonna google that and just see what it is. Is it like tear and tear? <laughs> it's the same thing, you just have to figure same. it out by context. No, that is secreting. How do you secrete? Oh, dude, a it's the, gun the R and the E. The, you, you're reading it as if the R and the E are swapped. No, wait, no. I'm just, I'm just autistic. No, this is secrete. So this is like to, um, to discharge, right? Yeah, but this is, is, secre is secreting a word? Secreting is not a word. Because this, this, like, this can't say secreting. You acquire a pistol in a fine mahogany case and make a show of secreting it within reach of your bed. Does that sentence make sense, Shadow? Nope. 
So it's you acquire a pistol in a fine mahogany case and make a show of secreting it within your reach of, within reach of your bed. That makes more sense. Yeah. It's a perfect size to conceal well, a Rock okay, so, 3 and would make it such now, a pink red place from which to ambush you. Now maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure you can only secrete something that is liquid. But then again, who, what do I know? I'm not a, not very good at English. You're not a fallen London writer, is what you are, not are. Well, I have to assume that they're better at English than me, because their job is literally to write. Well, if they didn't have an English literature degree before they wrote this, they got one afterwards, <laughs> just for free. <laughs> just you walk up to university, you show them, I wrote Fall in London, they're like, ah, here's a free degree. <laughs> it's, it's probably like a whole... How many books do you reckon content is here in Fall in London? Assuming you've paid and you've got your, you know, you've paid and you've got access to everything. Honestly, I reckon so there's far, like 20 I've, books. So far, I feel like we've, we've read maybe half a book. <laughs> That's true, but we've only seen the free shit. True. Well, we gotta pay some money at some point, but for now, you awake to tittering sound from the box. The trap is sprung. You reach for the latch and find yourself held at the point of your own pistol, wielded awkwardly by three rats. They force you out of your lodgings in your undergarments and lock the door behind you. What the fuck? I got forced out of my house by rats? Yeah. They've really nailed down the London experience. Right, let's do that again. You acquire... Uh, oh, this let me see. That, uh, they can't resist. They slip into the case while you feign sleep. Tittering to themselves in anticipation of their big moment. Such a pity that the box has all those nice dirty latches. You release the rat lieutenant several streets away under oath to take no further part in the conflict. Now we lost three. What, what is this anyway? Not every day the need the same. A rat runs along an iron railing, leaping each spike like an acrobat. For the scuttering company, he shrills. And Excuse me, I would, I, would, I would like to request that. a more... I'd like to request a more rat-like voice for the for the scuttering. For the scuttering company. There we better. go. <laughs> Much better, thank you. Alright, let's go with let's just always go with the lowest. Per let's persuasive them. Let's give let's parlay. Yeah. They're having none of it. Oh. <laughs> it's fucking rats, dude. <laughs> A scuffle, a pool of blood, a wild-eyed girl with a knife in either hand, the cry goes up. A check. Is it a check? She's gone regardless. What does that mean? Who was who was talking? Was that a rat talking? It's, it's a bat sips pass not far overhead. You call a halt to hostilities and engage in a surprising civil discussion with the rats. They regard your lodgings as their own and are intent on reclaiming it for rat kind. No solution is reached, although a few read this heard during the negotiations, and do hear some interesting gossip. That said, it is distressing to realize how often rats are about listening. Oh, I'm gonna get these fucking rats. Get the fuck out of my house. And I'm going to do a Play them. With candlestick and poker, you maul your way to grimly legendary status in the stories of rats. They are a tricksy and soul. But they have yet to effectively counter your thump with a big mail stick stratagem. Uh, and then we go back to dueling them. And then we fail. Oh, You've we're down to four rats. If we make the next two checks, we're free. Yes. You Let's killed go. an LB lieutenant who got too close while lining up a shot at you. On the other hand, you've had thick, thick piney pulls out of your arms, and the rats have stolen all of your socks. Oh, the okay. final oh! battle and fa face the rats' father chief. The chief of rats has de decided to deal with you personally. He stalks from the rubble of your cloakroom, loading his blunderbuss. Okay, hear me out. We, when I think when we're doing Let's Plays, we always want to end when we're hot. And right now, we're pretty hot. I I think we pause it here because we are out of actions. There is no way we kill this guy today. Well, we have two actions, and we can either go for the kill or try to take him alive. Oh, I mean, you reckon it's just literally go for the kill and he's dead? I assumed it was like a boss fight because that's a boss rat. You want to find out? You want to spend a hard-earned lesson and try to kill him? 
Let's hey, let's go, let's go, let's kill this fucking rat. Victory! There's a reason humans walk above the earth and rats go below. You've demonstrated that today. You generously permit the scattered refugees from the LB colony to bear their fallen leader way in peace. You do take the opportunity to slip a strike named pill into the corpse's mouth, as if been known to eat their dead after all. While sweeping away the remnants of their fortifications, you come across a fold of blood spattered paper, a map or a piece of one. Your lodgings are now free of rats. Yay! And we have a partial map. See, we did it. Rats is far but a threat or menace. The respected journalist Mr. Hoffam is writing an article on his rats. They've become a matter of public concern, he says, licking his pencils. Oh, what is your uh, expert uh, opinion? Uh, excuse me, sir. What is your expert opinion? So, is it a noble creature's? Or is the only good rat is a dead rat? It's like, oof. Oh. You might say, you might be able to say that about the. I, f I forgot what was written previously. The, the, was it the, the boss rat? The, no, what did was it the Netherlands? Was it the Danish? Was it the Swedish? Oh, which of yeah, the yeah, we, we was saw something. It was something like find the criminal, and it said, oh god, it's always the Danish. <laughs> was it the Danish? <laughs> Let's say it was the Danish. All right, it's like oh, the only the. Whatever. I, I, the point is kind of lost now. What's Brilliant. Our, what's our choice? I, I'm i feeling like I want to go full full conspiracy and go, Hey man, this goes way deeper than you could possibly know, journalist. I have stared into the pyramid and have seen what the rats are really up to. Lodging's rats have grown bold, even arrogant, and with good reason. The truth that no one dares acknowledge is right in front of your eyes. Beneath their cloaks and hoods, the mats of the bazaar are nothing more than giant bipedal rats. Mr. Huffam writes diligently, the truth will out. Hey, we got rid of our wounds! Alright, I think a lot of dangers. This, is, this is a good place to stop. Well, I quickly want to travel to Watchmaker's Hill and find out. Oh, we've, look, we've tons of new things here now. Oh That's shit, the blacks! The rats were actually cock blocking us. Yeah, finally, this is finally. This is what I when I start when we started. This is the thing I was looking forward to most is fucking monster hunting in Watchmaker's Hill, and then the rats came, and, uh, <laughs> and they've been a scorch upon our playthrough for ages. But not anymore. Finally, it's we can get back to what we it's really us, want. It's taken us literal months to get rid of these rats, dude. I mean. <laughs> Hey, I didn't. I I needed to keep buying more bullets to shoot them in the walls. Oh, fair. <laughs>